standing in front of one of our new listings in the beautiful Tar Hill section of Murphy, only about a mile and a half from downtown Murphy's restaurants and shops. It's an awesome location. The address is 200 Wandering Falls. Here we are at the outside walking up onto the open deck that'll bring us onto a wraparound porch covered on both sides. There's a little bit of storage off to the side for some outside items. Oh, here we've got Wayne and John sitting on the porch enjoying the beautiful weather. And a nice mountain view. You got a nice wide open deck. And then it does go around to the um, other covered porch. You can hear a small creek on the property in front of the porch. And a nice porch swing. Now I'm going to walk back into the house. Oh, Corinna's just joined them. They're work. They're, I'm working and they're relaxing. Okay, here we are in the house. Beautiful warm colors. We've got tongue and groove on the ceilings. And it matches the hardwood floors. Nice wide open plan. Lots of windows. Especially that wall of windows. Large dining area. Perfect for that farmhouse table. Opens right up into the great room with the fireplace. And that's a wood-burning fireplace. People like that. Lots of nice natural light coming in. All wood floors. We've got carpet in the basement, but everything else are wood floors. Okay, we're in the kitchen. We've got stainless steel appliances. Nice cabinetry and granite countertops. It's a nice workable kitchen that's set aside but still open to the great room. Okay, we'll do the basement afterwards. We're gonna go into the main level bedroom. This is a nice size room. Then we've got a queen size bed. Actually, that might be a king. The furniture's included in this property at the price of $259.8. Not sure if I mentioned that. And it's really nice furnishings and decor. But a good size room and it opens up to that side deck with this nice swing listening to the creek. We'll go back inside. Oh, we gotta check out this sign. No peeing off the porch. Come back inside. Good size room. Nice solid wood doors too. It's in excellent condition. Here we've got our laundry area. Very common for the chalets to have it there. Some storage shelves. And right across from that is the main level bathroom. It's a good size vanity. It's a tub shower. Cute little decor items. Okay, we'll come back out past the kitchen into the great room. All that beautiful light. Sun is really shining today. I'm going to go upstairs again, hardwood floors. Um, this particular chalet has an open loft. That's the view from up above. All those windows and nice tongue and groove ceiling. So this is a loft space. Um, perfect for an office. It's a sofa bed, so if you have extra guests, an extra place to sleep. More windows. Now the master bedroom is closed off, so it's private. Sometimes you'll find that the lofts have the bedroom that's opened. This one we've got it closed off, and you can see there's also a door that goes out to a balcony here too. Good size room. Let's take a peek outside. Now this porch swing is surrounded by peaceful woods, and there's that mountain view. What I like about Tar Hill is it's so close to downtown. In fact, I live very close to this home. 
two miles and I'm by the restaurants. It's just so easy, so convenient, all paved roads. But yet this home offers a lot of privacy for the location being so close to town. It's awesome. Big uh, tub, jacuzzi tub with a tiled shower. A vanity. Okay, we'll come back through. Okay. Come back down the stairs and more windows. Can't have too much light coming through your home. Say hi to Mr. Bear. Nice rustic decor, tastefully. And now we're going to go downstairs into the finished basement. It's a large game room. It's really nice. What I like about this downstairs is it's a uh, dual heat. So we've got a thermostat um, so we can control heat and air downstairs separate from upstairs. But you also do have a uh, propane fireplace in the corner. There's my thermostat. It's a little extra when you've got um, double zoned. There's a shuffleboard. Makes for a fun time. And that sofa is also a futon. Now this room is awesome. Perfect for the grandkids. Four bunk beds. They'll love that. It's a big, big room. Then we've got the utility room. Hot water heater, HVAC. Just some extra storage. It's nice to have a little unfinished space so you can store some items. Oops, just almost past the bathroom. So that makes you the third bathroom in the house, one on each level. This video, if you can't tell, is unedited. So it's not perfection, that's for sure. But I wanted you to be able to get a feel of walking through the house. The door goes outside to the lower deck. So not only do we have wraparound deck above, we also have a deck on the lower level and go back inside and close up. And that's the house at 200 Wandering Falls.